Hello guys, it's Mungai Eve. Welcome to the Mungai Eve show and of course you're the number one online TV show. And guys, today we are here at uh, Ndovuniku. Uh, he has he's having an event, a listening party and with me Nikona Brida. Eh, hey, for the first time to Nafatana. You're so huge. Nimekula ume unajua umeena? Mhm. Unajua Fulu? Do you know what Fulu is? No, I don't. Go on Google. What's that? Eh, ni, 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 ni chakula. Mm -hmm. eh, ukikula yota kwa mkubwa kama mm hiyo. -hmm. Mm. That's a lie. Anyway, at Ukoapa, of course, all of us are here because of Ndovu Niku. I'd like to know, what is your relationship with him? Uh, Ndovu ni, Ndovu ni, ni charge. Ni mse, ni mejona na ye since nge kwa industry. We also did a song together in it pattern. Eh, ni mse tutu na Joanna, apart from mziki, is someone like si wongea. Atuna ti hile urafikitu ya mziki peke. Eh, so na pia ni msani, ni, msani, ni msani mkali mwenye na ishimu pia. So that's why I'm here. Yeah. Okay. Uh, tonight uh, tuko kwa listening party. Ata kwa kituwekea ana premier song pale. Tusikize. Wewe kama mtu mwenye unamuamini ya na umekua kisikiza angoma zake. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe you've been there in the making of some of his songs. Una, una expect nini tonight? Una expect tu ya ni genjeness. Dobe kwe kitu kali. Of course na jwa ni kitu kali. So I'm just here. Pia na rakusikia. Ni unina kuwaje. Yeah. We speak right now, uh, recently kumekuwa na vita kubwa kati ya rapper WTZ na hapa kwetu Kenya. Na tuliona pia ulingia pale, ukaachia kitu. Anyway, I'd like to know, uh, if wewe kama rapper wa hapa kwetu, what do you think about the whole thing that has been happening? Uh, the whole thing was basically just sport. Uh, sport in Hagana Kompe. It was just a lyrical confrontation. Uh, when I'm no in the studio, I was just like, I'm in the studio. I was studio. I was rap, I was in the studio. I was basically compared to yani, between us and our neighbors. Yani, I was in Kali. I was in challenge. I was in the studio. 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 Let's work together manze, for the good of the East African music. Yeah, seen. One of the person when you make a story, it's an apology. It's ni Rosary, and as we speak, ako hapa kwe to Kenya. I would like to know, um, where where do you think I may peleka? I may vuta sana, ama ako tu sawa. Well, you know, I may vuta sana. Ina zangu kwa mi. Ina ina itangua when opportunity meets preparation. So I guess maybe I'll go prepared for that opportunity. I mean, she can am konombili amenda na, which is 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 okay, pia. Eh yeah, bado kaka kuna anyone from Kenya na feel anaweza endelea na hayo endelee. Si mimi nilitoa mbili. Mimi nilitoa dis mbili. Actually niko na dis sita. Zilikuwa ready. Ni kutoa tu sikutoa junior na acha itulie pia. Big Baba si wapeleke mbio sana. But I'm mean, your opportunity. It's, it's it's good. But only good business for her. Okay. Yeah. And genuinely, what do you think about uh, comparing our rap in there? Ni gani una rank sana? Ah, rap ya Kenya iko juu. Rap ya Kenya iko juu. Kenya una Kenya una pata rap ni za roga na kijaka, ana roga na kishenga, ana roga na piwa swahili. Mimi kiniambia sasa ni roga na Kiswahili sanifu I will. Unaona? Unaja for for so many years people feel and think that just because they rap in pure Swahili, what on now? Oh, na jaza ni mashairi wa kofiti zi. Sit ko way much evolved to not do different sounds. Ukipata wale una jana kwa mystic to just this one sound. Kwa hip hop tunita ga boom bap na ile to do do do. Una get? But manzi una skia breeder na zaku rapi ya kwa beat ya wah. Mi kwa zamu toa freestyle kumi ni mimi mbana wangla ni mimi mbana beat ya dancehall. Tuko na diversity. Unajua, lyrically pia tunaileta. Unajua, ni vile tu sa huku mtani watu penda kuchorea tivi tu za mtani. Wano, haa, pana, hizi. Hii ya Kenya si fiti, indo fiti. Lakini sini wanoma, bro. Sini wa deadly mungai, manze. What do you think about Tanzanians kuzini kama wakufiraia? Most of them actually ukiangalewa kwa comment section. They felt really offended. Do you think maybe they misunderstood the whole situation? Yeah, they misunderstood it. But basically, it was just lyrical confrontation. Si marapo inyo ni wa deadly kwa nge studio. It's the same thing uwe Rosa na do. Studio. It starts and ends in the studio. Unajua? Mi si this citizens what is head. Ni marapo what is head. Unaget? Msi aku huko kwa jantake sawa, but saya when it comes to rap, mi mesema, ay buda, mi ni mnoma kukushinda. 
na nakwambia mbona mimi ni mnaoma kukushinda mm -hmm. na ndaku deceive na hivi na hivi unaona mm -hmm. ni, ni 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 kawaida ya hip hop yani unajua ni hip hop mm -hmm. that's why uwezi pata hasa wenye una imbaga umemkasubui wana wewe uwezi amkasai useme manzi mimi kama unga hivi mimi ni mnaoma kushinda lilomi zi because that's not the nature of what you guys do <laughs> as wa sawa media but sasa sisi yetu ni compare manze naweza mkasaini ni sema mimi ni mnoma kushinda Eminem na ni kuonyesha mbona mimi nasema mimi ni mnoma kushinda Eminem hiyo ni kawaida ya hip hop clash confrontation compare but lyrics kwa studio si ati nakuja nikupige zi unajua eh yeah. Tukia hapo kwa uh, nani mnoma kuliko nani. There was a time uliulizwa in Kenya who are your favorite artists. Na uka mention pale ni kwa Nasaru, uh, Kanambo, Dana Marua. Unajua, you mentioned a few artists who you believe in. As a rapper and someone who is doing well in in the field that you are. What do you look at do you unidentify that msani mwenye umetaja pale in one of the best that we have? Uh, basically to how good are you like when it comes to lyricism how good how good are you when it comes to flowing on a, on a beat yani unajua umekiwa beat hapo ki rap uh, approach yako ni gani are you creative ama uko to still just one flow the same flow the same lyrics each and every time unajua we pia comes and ni pia branding yako kona vako me believe sana in i feel like music is a very competitive field what's your branding weka munga even na kagano na gona kugomeka purple ah say it kwa hapa sayo una uko na branding yao there's a color there's an identity are you aware of all these things yani ama umeingia tu kwa hii biz tu hivyo tu unaona so mimi utambua wasi wanajitambua na wasi wame understand hii biz na wana push to the next level yeah okay where list yako you mentioned uh, Diana Diana Bahati ama Diana B that's what she calls herself when it comes to music and uh, she came to the industry as a rapper na watu wengi sana wamekuwa ki criticize uh, her songs and everything but where will you identify kama one of your best what makes her uh, the best according to you according to me na feel kwanza kuna confidence which is very important you can be dope yani than the next person but are you confident in yourself are you confident enough kushika mic kuchukua beat na ku rap vitu na rap do you believe in yourself me i'm, I'm big on self belief unajua because me na feel kasi ngekuwa na self belief yani mziki ni tough sana ningekuwa nimeachana nayo unajua but na jitambo hiyo design hapana na sukuma hii kitu so ha kwa hiyo virtue ya kujitambua ku even take on that challenge na kusema i don't give a a damn yani about everyone else i don't give a damn about what you have to say about me mimi nda imba na respect hiyo kitu sana cuz mimi ni msena interact na wasanii wengi na najua so many talented artists wenye wezi fikata the next level just because they don't have self belief najua yeah so that's what uh, makes you feel like she is one of the best you know eh ni 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 dem dope najua eh jo anajitambua anajitambua then of the day anachukua beat na roga unajua hiyo list ilikuwa na sawa tano eh kila mseni according to kuna different values nimeona kwao na different attributes zenye nimeona kwao yeah okay recently you shared on your stories about uh you feel like uh in our country tuko na uh, tuko na shida ya tribalism like it is still there as much as people maybe try to ignore ama to assume that we've moved from that uliandika pale ukaandika vitu mob sana i'd like to know what makes uh, what made you write that post is it something that you've been through ama ni kitu tu no observe uh, basically uh, tribalism ni kitu mimi personally ni my experience from a very young age mm -hmm. na ni kitu I, I didn't realize it until nika nika grow ndo nikajua okay hii kitu ilikuwa nini unajua and i feel ni kitu ina ina tradition nyuma to a certain extent unaona especially uki uki uki, uki, uki go to other parts of the country that's when you'll understand the tribalism in our work na um, effects zake na impact yake on people so na feel ni kitu inafuatwa chana na mimi sasa hii mimi sijali wewe hata ni tribe gani i don't even care but tuko hapa tunaongea nikusijui ndio huni tribe gani man but niko hapa unajua at the end of the day nafuatwa tunashikana tunasonga mbele unaona yeah but ni kitu hiko but tujaribu kuichorea manze eh inatudisha nyuma so, hey, yeah do you think it's something that ina to push nyuma sana 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 in, in, in certain fields in certain areas na feel ina tradition nyuma but 
to me which areas can you identify maybe whereby tribalism ime uh, iko bado well i can't i can't really at point out mm -hmm. all areas you know just as a, mm -hmm. uh, that's another topic and yeah, we need to sit down intellectually na tunaongea tunasema yeye unajua ni hapa na hapa na hapa na hapa unajua then it's also a very sensitive topic yenye staki ni sema kitu yenye iko off tena watu wanaweza kusema oh sijui ni nini nini unajua Uh, but and I feel too basically nikitutwa chane nayo any time you feel like you want to be tribal for any reason chorea kwanza usiniangalie jumini wa tribe gani z niangalie mika breed na kusaidiana nini ama tunaweza saidianaje tujengane unajua na wewe kama ungai if mimi naweza nijengaje naweza jengana sawa tuzi jengana on to the next one unajua yeah a few years ago i think it was in 2021 we lisema una charge a uh, 1 million kwa show right now we are in 2023 mm -hmm. uh, economy pia ni ngumu ningetaka kujua ile rate imepanda ama pia umeshukisha kidogo <laughs> <laughs> una jua economy ni mbaya lakini kazi inaendelea tu eh, kazi inaendelea tunataka hata sasa kupandisha unajua eh, tunataka kupandisha um, rada tu ni chafu na rates rates my watu wafike tu baby unajua pia sanii mkiona nimepiga Tom Ford hapa hii sio tini mbonya chip bana nikipiga Festina unaona unaona ni glow in the dark unaiona ama uone mungai ina glow ama iglow endo browse on any mbote ya donga hapa ukiona nimepiga hivi lazima pia msafike bendo mnisa pia nikitokea natokea nikiwa nimepiga luku yangu na kafiti brand pay miss mama fi fiti si ndio Yeah. Okay most of the time tukitaja breeder na tukim uh, tukimtaja kwa mambo ya mahusiano ama relationship watu wanakusema sana wewe na Mandy there is something that goes on maybe you can tell us what is your relationship with her breeder una join a very polygamous man mimi kona mimi na bibi lakini niko na associates associates kona associates relationship associates yani na, na ni wengi yani unajua eh yeah. so Mandy is not one of them ama she's one of them and uh, Mandy you know, kuna relationship associates na kuna watu wa busy yani wenye tunaweza patana tu imbe juu tunaweza imba doba noma unajua eh yeah. lakini mtu unao respect kama sanii ni msanii noma yani the baddest female artist yani mwenye mimi nishaiona hapa Kenya mm, but yet kuna any any relationship association apart from the business association mm -hmm. ni associate wa kibiz <laughs> wa relationship ni wengi bana ni kupe list hebu ataje wewe manze manze mambo swangu wote manze hebu tokezeeni bana wase waone bana wanashindwa kinyekelea manze mnamwekelea demo wa watu bana jo niko na mabibi wengi lakini ni nyio muajui ndakuletea moja umuone okay kwani wewe unatupanga kuwa wangapi ama hutaki kuwa mimi mimi na jamii ni ama polygamous man. Yaani niko na bibi wengi manze. Ki, ki, reckless alisema buda kila esto jiji ni na bibi. Mimi mm -hmm. sana na bibi kila constituency. Mm -hmm. Au ni wangapi? Hai, hadi constituency yetu hata uijui. Uko nini? <laughs> ah. Kwetu shagu. Kirinyaga ama ya gani? <laughs> kwanza Central kwanza mimi napenda wasapere. Mimi napenda wasapere mbaya. Wanjiro. Wamboi Wanjiko Wewe ni Wanjiko Waidera Nyambura That's just knowing their names Modoni ah niko na niko na madem kwa kila clan ya Wasapere Si mko na 12 clans Niko na madem kwa hizo 12 clans Modoni Waidera Wamboi Wanjiro Wanjiko Waidera Nyambura Modoni Mungai Isa isa mail name. Ni a mail name hapo hapa na mail hapa. Wapo wa peke yake, wapo wa peke ya mail. Ai mail hapa na. Toa bibi bwanga pia ama uta. 200. wives. For what reason? Nigeria. Ah, woni vile mimi natoshana. Mimi sasa tena mimi ndakoje na dem moja bibi moja. Kenya. Mimi ni mtu niko na nguvu. Mungai kwani unioni? So huge. Manze mimi ngifanya hivi kwanza nimeshikilia wa super saba pekee sasa hiyo ndakoje na msupa moja mm ruabe okay. do you think out 200 they will agree to that kind of a marriage sasa si hao na wanafaa agree 
Wewe si unapenda Big Baba? Eh, wewe penda Big Baba, kuna mwingine tena. Eh. Kwa mambo ya ya wapoa. Kuna pale lile nilionauliza maswali, una ati unashtuka sana watu bado wanapeleka na dates in this time and era. Unaenda gadet? Unaenda gadet lakini wewe wewe unaweza kupeleka date. Ah, na sisi sema upeleka. Au unajua nilisema ina depend. Hiyo interview wa kukata. Unaona? Hiyo interview ungekata, ungeona nilisema ina depend. Ina depend. Ilisema kana you are shocked, ulisema you are shocked that people still go on dates. I was shocked eh? But ina depend kuna poa yani mimi naweza peleka date. Lakini basically mimi nafika msetu umetulia jana. Eh ngipata Does it take for you to take a, a lady uh, to a date? Nataka de mwenye ni chizi kama mimi. Mhm. De mwenye ni chizi, mimi ni chizi. Zero zero 001 patient hapo madhare. Mhm. Well, I'm trying to talk to her with the same 200. Na kwani wa super wako hapa the same energy the same wazim wapo wapo wako hapa yani mimi nakuona wapo wa 200 tunakanika keja ni asylum kwani wapo wako Kenya peke yake mimi na mapoto riko colombiana cubana hapa tz pia nime nime rap rap kidogo nimepata msuko huko <laughs> tukimalizia yeah. uh, you once shared that your celebrity crush uh, ni aziad na cartoon comedian uh nikitaka kujua wamebadilika ama bado ni wale wale hadi sasa hivi nimekuongeza hapo eh unakafiti sana unakapoa lakini wewe umechukuliwa sasa kitu kinafanyika nime change hiyo list ndaiandika tena wale tunawatoa ama bado wako wale nikiangalia azia bado wako hapo lakini nataka kuupdate hiyo list kwa kwa update sio una updating ma app kwa simu ni update. Sawa ni wa kwanza kwa hiyo list. And I update. Ni update. Okay. Anyway, tukimalizia Brida, what do you tell all your fans? My fans. Yo yo yo, my fans wangu kwanza ni TK Nation, manze TK Nation. Manze shukran sana for kuni hold down. Ni time yote nimeingia kwa industry hadi sasa hii. Big things on the way, yani ni kubaya. Album ina come. Yani sijui yani. Wasio bless up yani Brida na kuja na ubaya, yani ni kubaya yani unajua yeah so shout out to TK Nation kila mse mwenye uni support boom ni kubaya sana thank you so much brida uh, we really appreciate for your time uh, guys tumekuwa na brida in case watching this video make sure you hit the subscribe button you share we meet in the next one thank you